Hi, everyone. I'm Amy Leah Tamburini, the CEO of Hum Consulting and the host of the Circle of Change podcast. Today on Be the Change, we are talking about communication. Why is communication so important to being the change? Well, do you remember the Mobius strip? If not, that's okay. Go back and watch the video on the relationship between our inner and outer worlds. Essentially, communication is so important because it is that moment where our inner world meets our outer world. And in that moment, we can intentionally create what we want to have ripple out into the rest of the world. Pretty powerful, right? I'm passionate about this topic because communication has been a major challenge for me, especially in my most intimate relationships. I have spent many, many years saying what I thought needed to be said to keep the waters calm or saying nothing at all and then blowing up, saying a bunch of things I regret, often after I'd had a few drinks. Can you relate to that at all? The work of communication begins with our internal world. First and foremost, recognizing that with every interaction, there are things going on inside of us, some of which we have control over, some of which we don't. Where our power lies is in increasing our awareness of what is happening for us. I have found that the easiest place to start is becoming aware of our body sensations. What are we feeling? For example, you run into somebody and they say, oh my gosh, I love your scarf. Mm. You feel all warm and fuzzy inside in that moment and very relaxed. And then your boss walks by and he says, I need to talk to you. Can you meet me in my office? Mm. Ooh. Now what's happening? In a split second, you might feel nauseous and your stomach might feel clenched or maybe you get hot and sweaty. How can that happen? How can we go in a split second from feeling warm and fuzzy to nauseous and constricted. Well, we're going to get into that next week. This week, I invite you to start noticing what are those body sensations that arise during your interactions with others. See if you can find any patterns. And before you go, what I really want to know is what are your biggest communication challenges? What are those situations where you are getting all tripped up? Put those in the chat and message me. The answers to this question are going to help us shape a very exciting free opportunity that we're bringing to you on December 2nd. So let us know because we really want to make sure that we're addressing the very things that you're working on right now in your life. See you next week. Ciao.